Hi, this is Connor. I'm back playing Skyrim. Um, you may remember our character here, Jacques, Jacques Lebard, who is train has just enrolled at Bard University. He's a noble uh, high elf, as you can see. Very handsome man. So, yeah, he's enrolled in Bard School and was just given a quest to retrieve some book of a band play or something. Oh, I don't have to sleep to level up. Oh, okay. I thought I had to sleep to level up. What do I want to increase? Um. Okay. Health, I suppose. I need to be more durable at this stage. Or do I want to increase stamina? Or magicka? I could eventually become very, very magically powerful. Hmm. I don't normally play for magic in Elder Scrolls. And I'm a... I'm a bard, though. Do bards use magic? I don't know. I'm going to try magic. I'm a high elf, after all. I should have some skill in it. Actually, no. Hell. Magic. Oh, I can't decide. I can't decide. I'm going to flip a coin. Uh, heads, magic, tails, health. If it lands on one end, then stamina. Heads, magic. Okay, what magic school would I learn stuff from? Hmm, illusion, conjuration, restoration, alteration. Which is alteration? Water, breathing, paralysis, that kind of thing? Nah. Restoration, I'm not some kind of white mage. Conjuration, being able to summon the undead. I never summon things. So... I want to become a novice of conjuration. Because I never do so many magic in the, these games. So I should. I'll get some monsters to do my fighting for me. I'm a bard. I'm not meant to fight things. I'm here to make documentaries about animals. Which way am I going? Uh, I can't remember. Map. That's my current location. What was my quest? Where am I meant to go? probably in my journal tending to the flames okay there we go I'll get rid of quest markers for that other quest get rid of my uh, custom marker so where am I going okay south of town away I go that's a wall and this is a castle. Um, this way. Oh no, I'm going to have to pass that Argonian who doesn't like me again. You, you help me. You help people, right? That's what you do. Someone wants help. Uh, no. I don't know where they got this story that I help people from. It's probably because I interrupted that execution by accident. No, that's a castle as well. Um, I'm hopelessly lost. This will just be the rest of my video series, wandering around the city looking Hello, for the way out. I'm the Dean of History and Scribe Work when I can find some quiet time. He looks like he's accidentally walked out in his pajamas. He's got one of those little sleeping pajama hats. Does anyone actually wear those? I've never Oh no. Oh, it's you again. Come on. Come on, dude. I mean, you're leveling up my ma my skills and all, but come on. Right, let that be a lesson to you. Where can I buy magic here? If I'm going to be leveling up magic. This looks like a pawn shop. Clothes. Um, the winking skeever. I don't know what goes on in there. This looks like alchemy. I don't think they do spells. Um... Oh. I don't know. Do I know magic? It's conjuration I want. I don't even know any conjuration. I know some destruction. That's no good to me. Ah! Leave me alone. The guard's going to take care of this. No. He's running away. Okay, look. I'm out of here. I don't have time for this. 
Look at that poor little Argonian there cleaning that cup. He's a nice Argonian. This Jarira isn't isn't a nice one, most definitely. He's just is he still going to follow me out here? He's still here. Leave me alone, you insane Argonian. You're just leveling up my weapons, so I'm doing more damage to you. Stupid and unkillable NPCs. They didn't have that in Morrowind. Back, you know, in the golden age of the Elder Scrolls. I can jump really high, I've just realised. Maybe because I'm going downhill, it seems higher than it is. My little friend following me. No. Which way am I going? This way? Yeah, I think so. This two sword fighting is ridiculous. It's going to get me killed. No one fights with two swords, with good reason, because you can only hit with one of them at a time, I think. Let me check. Oh! Actually, that's not bad. I hit left, right, or... I should have leveled up stamina. Oh, well, next level. My next level goes to stamina. Yeah, two sword fighting seems kind of cool. Okay, what's that? I hope this place isn't too dangerous. I'm kind of new in town. You know, I'm, I'm not designed for this kind of thing. I'm just a bard. This is a really weird entrance exam. If I was going into college and they asked me, you know, to wander into the forest and steal a book from some dangerous ruins, I'd just... I'd tell them where to go. I've just noticed there's a stone thingy up here. I forget what they're called. Magic stony things to give you a skill bonus or something. I was going to go investigate, but it's across the water. Forget it. I'll get it later. Ah, here we see the real monster spider. Now, that was pretty cool. More venom. No, I don't need that. There's another one over here. The frostbite spider creeps up on its prey. Oh, definitely should have leveled up stamina. That it didn't even cross my mind as something useful. I was thinking, I'm not sprinting anywhere. I'm not. I'm hardly jumping. Now stamina it is. But I should learn some magic, just to you know make use of that. Uh, level I put in it. Because you do have to level up everything. I'm not going to keep my health at just 100 the whole way through. I'll get killed. Straight over the hills. I don't know why they bother with the roads. No one walks on the roads. Snow again. Very suddenly. <laughs> oh. Is that a wolf or a dog? Oh, I think it's a wolf. Ah! Wolves! So, is that one already dead? Oh, they both are. This is badass. I'm... Yeah, two-sword fighter. I'm just a damage machine. the way. Ugh. No, I, I can't jump high enough yet to get through there. I'll have to walk around. This kind of, like, way of finding a route, it's just unique to Bethesda games. It's hopping on mountains that you're really, you're probably not meant to be able to climb. Alright, where is it? 
over here. Oh, here's the place. <laughs> I've come at it from completely the wrong direction. Well, time to go inside. Uh, do I have to write my exam number somewhere? Or, um... I suppose I'll just come back with the book. What are these embalming tools? If someone wants to do some taxidermy out in the fresh air, I suppose. I have no problem with that. It's a little weird. Not for me. I'm gonna go inside. There might be interesting specimens for me to learn about for my uh, educational rap for the school kids. I should sneak around all the time because I have to creep up on the creatures, get them in their natural habitat. Oh yes, we have entered the lair of the ancient ghosts. Ho oh, ho! Here we see one of the ghosts standing with a crossbow. This is weird, the carpet's flickering. What was in those cabbages I ate earlier? Oh. oh. I think I've been spotted. There's no real reason to sneak. A ruby dragon claw. Ooh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ah! Oh no, low stamina, low stamina. Oh, they're not coming through that door. Cowards, come on. Oh no, now they are. Oh, they're not so bad. That was easy enough. Is someone still hitting me? I thought, I, I thought someone was hitting me. Oh, Mr. Arrow Man. Hang on, I'll level up. I think that restores my health. Uh, stamina. Stamina this time. What combat things can I level up? One-handed. Um, there's no dual weapon thing I can level up. What else is there in Conjuration that I can learn? Because I do want to do a bit of Conjuration. Dual casting, Mystic Binding. Now that can be like my secondary thing. I'm a dual wheel dual weaponed conjurer uh one handed there we go I'm an armsman a man with arms hello mr skeleton I will see you in the afterlife oh I've got an arrow coming out of my neck that can't be good. Let me get a look at that. Oh, I have to put my weapons away, I think. But, oh, it's gone. It must have fallen out. It's okay. Jacques is unharmed. What have we got here? Ancient arrows. I don't, I don't know. Do I have a better bow than that? Actually, one thing I've just remembered. I can equip my weapons to uh, favourites. So I can stick my current weapon, my Imperial Swords, in favourites. And I could also stick in... What's that bow? Damage 10. And what damage is the bow here? Damage 9. Okay, I already have a better bow. I can also stick this bow in favourites. And then if I press... Oh, if I press Q... I can switch between them really quickly. Um, oh, why are the arrows in favourites? No. Number one will be my swords, and number two will be my bow. So now I can press... I can, when I have my weapons out, press two to change to my bow and arrow. Press one to go back to my swords. It's very cool. You won't learn that in any tutorial. So let's have a look. Some garnets, some more arrows. Um, I don't want to carry too much rubbish with me. I suppose I better carry these swords just because I 
could probably sell them for a lot. For, get some money for them. Yeah, those bows are worth a bit. Um, actually, are those swords better than mine? No, they're rubbish. Nord Engineering, it's terrible. Give me Imperial any day. More embalming tools. It's like a taxidermy museum. Like, I don't think they generally do the embalming in the grave. It seems a bit late for that kind of thing. Ooh, a silver ring. Alright. Let's venture deeper. Try and find this book. Go! Oh, well, I should look out for those things. That was close. Oh, right. It can be set off multiple times. Okay, maybe I can disable it somehow. No. The way to disable it is just not step on it, I guess. No, which way was it? Mr. There's nothing over here. It's caved in. Phew, it's a good thing the cave with the important stuff in it isn't the one that caved in. It never is. Better sneak. Have a sneaky sneak into the cave. Oh, soul gems. I need them if I want to enchant stuff later on. And... What else? A big burning thing. Oh. Oh, a chain. Should I pull it? Will this just flush a big toilet somewhere? Let's see. Oh, that's a very cool door. It's the ghost again. Casper, come back. I will be your friend. Let's see. A bit of gold. I don't know why there are beggars in the Elder Scrolls universe. You can just literally pick up money from everywhere. People throw it around. Someone's watching me. Uh-oh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, there's spiders. Little spiders. I'll just trap them under a glass or something. I don't even need to bother with the swords. Uh, let's see. Something hidden behind this webby wall. Oh, another door. I don't know if that's the right way to the exit or if the other way is. Is there more behind here? Ah. Oh. Aha. A war hammer. Yeah, it's worth a bit of money. I'm getting close to my carry limit, so I better be careful. Ooh, presents! Or people, I don't know. There could be dwarves tied up in there or something. Oh, is there also stuff under? Aha! I have discovered a chest of treasure! Uh -huh. Let's see what's inside. Okay, lock picking. Let me see if I remember how this goes. Ah, got it. Got it. An amethyst, gold, soul gem, stamina potion. Brilliant. Brilliant. I should steal from dead guys more often. I mean, clearly it's how you get by in this world. Well. It seems needlessly complicated. Ah. A skeletal scallywag, I see. He's got a very ni nicely trimmed beard for a skeleton. I mean, how does he sculpt it? Does he actually, like, shave or anything? Well, not shave, I suppose trim it. He'd have to. And it hasn't fallen out, even though most of his skin has fallen off. I want to know what his secret is. Head and shoulders. Probably. Or Pantene. Or some other shampoo brand. 
Just shampoo in general. I mean, look at Jacques. He clearly doesn't use shampoo. Oh, you nearly got me. 